Hi friends, I self Rajni. I am from JNTUA. Today I want to explain that binary search topic in data structures. The subtopic of this binary search is definition of binary search, why binary search uses, how does it works, condition and examples. Algorithm of binary search and examples. Binary search runtime and program explanation advantages and disadvantages of binary search and its conclusion. And then definition of binary search is in computer science binary search also known as half interval search logarithmic search or binary choke is a search algorithm that finds the position of a target values within a sorted array binary search in c is an example of simple process that can be used to resolve complex problems and then why binary search uses binary search is faster than linear search because the time complexity of linear search is big O of log of n and the time complexity of linear search is big O of n. However, the list should be in ascending order or descending order when hashing is rapid than binary search and it performs searches in constant time. And then how the binary search works is binary search algorithm applies to a sorted array for searching an element. The search starts with comparing target element with the middle element of the array. If the element matches the, the position of the element is written. The in and then conditions and examples for this binary search is Binary search can be all applied only on a sorted arrays. So the elements can be arranged in either ascending order if the elements are numbers. If the elements are strings, we must arrange in descending dictionary order only. The process what we wrote in this is the green tick mark is correct order for binary search and the wrong order is wrong itself. And then log algorithm for of binary search and its examples is the process is equal to middle is equal to first plus last first value is equal to small and the last values becomes big while last first va first value is less than or equal to last if array of middle value is less than search and then first value is equal to middle plus one. Else if, if array of middle value is equal to search, count is less than or equal to found at location. And then we should break the statement. Binary search is implemented using these steps. Read the search elements from the user and find the middle element in the sorted list. Compare the search element in the with the element in the sorted list. If both are matched, then display given elements is found. And terminate the function. If both are not matched, then check whether the search element is smaller or larger than the middle element. If the search element is smaller than the element, repeat steps 2, 3, 4 and 5 for the left sublist of the middle element. And then binary search is runtime for and some of the sizes of arrays. Binary search in is an in the logarithmic complexity class. If 2 power x is equal to n, x is equal to log of 2 of n. This is the runtime of binary search, how to calculate it. The program explanation for this binary search is slash into int main and the variables we use is c last first middle n search array of 100 elements and print f enter the element of the elements scan to scan the elements what we printed in the list and then for loop print f and then for first scan d first element is equal to 0 and the last element is equal to n minus 1 then the middle value becomes last plus 1 la, first plus 1 sorry first plus 1 lost by 2 while first is less than or equal to lost then the print value becomes the array of middle element 
less than search if it executes the first value less than or equal to last value then first value is equal to middle plus one else if if array of less than or equal to equal to double equal to printf is then we break the statement else last is equal to middle minus one middle is equal to last plus first plus last by two if first is greater than last printf is not found is not present in the list which we given in this then we should return the return of the value the output is enter how many elements you want we want I, we taken that five elements and the num indices we given is 1 9 22 24 46 the value we I want is 24 then in this program the 24 is executed at index 4 and then the advantages and disadvantages of binary search is a fairly simple algorithm based on the divide and conquer approach must faster in comparisons to the linear search linear search requires n by 2 and n comparisons per average and worst case scenarios binary search merely requires requires a lot of log of log of 2 of n comparisons respectively for more for more average and worst cases scenarios to put it to put in simplicity linear search on an average requires for 500,000 comparisons to made for a set of million elements binary search on the other hand requires nearly 20 comparisons and the and lastly the advantages for this binary search is complicated the where the binary search is complicated than the linear search great loss in efficient if the list does not support random access works only for the list that are sorted and kept on the list the time complexity analysis for this uh, analysis of binary searches as in each iteration the search reduces to the half of the array Thus, the time complexity of binary search algorithm is big O of log of 2 power 2 of n. Time complexity does not change irrespective of n, n position, if, even if it is not present in the array. The main advantage of this binary search is it eliminates half of the element from further searching by using the result of each comparison for large list of data it works insufficiently better than linear search and then the conclusion of this binary search is binary search trees are on are a very powerful data structures to have in way you using c program tool bit if done right handling large amounts of store sorted data becomes easier and quicker Finally, the binary search is one of the most common search algorithm and is useful in most of real world applications. And then thank you for listening this 